Okay, so me being a PC gamer, I've always been a fan of cool looking setups. I started out with an HP laptop, and so I never really had feeling of like a full out gaming setup, like a cool gaming setup. So I'm really happy right now. The other day, the, like a few days ago, I got a new gaming mouse, and which was really cool because I got to have one of those cool peripherals. And then I decided, hey, why not just get a keyboard? I got a Red Dragon mechanical keyboard, and it's the Kumara mechanical gaming keyboard. This is awesome. I'm gonna do a small review of it. We have a key remover, our cord here. Uh, it's not braided, but I don't really care. It has a gold plated, the USB is gold plated. And here is the keyboard. Oh my god, this is so cool. You hear that? It's awesome. Ah! It looks like it has an FN for control buttons, pause and play and stop. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really loving this font here. As you can see, there's a Windows lock key for while I'm gaming. And there isn't a number pad because nobody wants it. Let's look at the LEDs. So the different color options, you hold on FN and then they're all right here. So there's light one, light two, light three, light four, light five, light six, light seven, light eight. The light is out now. And I don't know, those ones are too dark, so, yeah. There's also a bunch of other things. Here, I'm gonna turn off lights for this. Like that. Okay, so we have CSGO loaded up, and we have the keyboard. Let's test it out. Okay, yeah, it, it passes the test. This is playable. Your mouse is way more important than your keyboard is. It's still nice to actually have something to be proud of. My final thoughts, it's a, it's awesome. It's, it's a really cool keyboard. I love it. It's awesome. Get it. It's about $40, which is pretty cheap for a mechanical keyboard with backlighting. Most of them are like above $100, so buy this. Bye.